Garbage. I really love 3D printing, but what I don't like is broken parts. Broke like nothing. Recently, I've been printing a lot of fully functional parts for my projects that are subject to stresses, vibration, and just real world situations. Let me show you what I'm talking about. For instance, this is a control box that I made where this cam turns and pulls this cable. I've only been using it like a week, and if you take a look, there's like some warping of this wall right here. This box here was printed with one of the highest strength PLAs that I know of. It's a carbon infused PLA, and it looks nice. Nice. The texture's nice. I'm really happy with it. Let me show you. Cable's out. Garbage. Look at that. Broke like nothing. Complete waste of money. And if you're wondering what I did to fix this problem, well, I just got another printer. I got my hands on a Mark Forged printer and I'm genuinely impressed, which is why I'm doing this video to show you. This is an identical box printed on the Mark Forged with just run of the mill Onyx filament. And let me just show you how strong this is. I'm gonna do the same breakage test I did on the carbon infused PLA on this, which is Onyx. Check this out. I cannot, I legitimately cannot break it. Okay, now time for the big boys. Again, same test. Like, these are huge pliers. Oh, I legitimately can't break it. Yeah, I'm telling you, no joke. I'm not even like, I'm trying with all my strength and these are some huge pliers. I want you to try. I want, I want to make sure people know that I'm not making up stories here. Which way are you doing it? Whatever way you want. Feel it. Yeah. What do you think? <sighs> Tough stuff. So this is how impressed I was when I first saw one of these parts and this isn't even carbon fiber reinforced. The way that I found out about this was I just ran into a part that was printed with one of their printers and I tried to break it. I was pretty impressed, which is why I just had to get my hands on one of these printers to start printing parts. And that is why I print all my parts I usually print with PLA on the Mark Forge. That's what this video is about. Hopefully you enjoyed it.